Now, the Lifetime movie, Aaliyah, Princess of R&B, is, is picking up steam. It's getting some heat. So originally, when Disney star Zendaya was cast as Aaliyah, a lot of people like was giving them a lot of backlash because they felt like she was too light-skinned and not good enough of an actress to play Aaliyah. So shortly thereafter, she left the project and was replaced with Alexandra Ship. Dish Nation was on the red carpet of the Teen Choice Awards, and we talked to Zendaya and asked her why she left the project, and this is what she had to say. For me, it was more so the production. It was more so, you know, the, the music rights. It was more so the family, you know, not being able to be in contact with the family was something that was really hard for me, and I, I wasn't really okay with. So there was multiple reasons why it wasn't just for me. It wasn't for me. This whole thing is looking raggedy. But here's the challenge. You can't talk about Aaliyah's life without including Timbaland and Missy because they were, like, two of the most important people in her life for up sure. until the day she died. Now they officially have their Missy Elliott and Timbaland. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you, Chatrice Dolabelle as Missy Elliott and Isaac Smith as Timberland. Okay, so this is a classic case of all black people don't look alike, okay? To me, though, this girl looks nothing like Missy Elliott. They should have cho chose Amber Riley. Amber Riley looks more like Missy no, Elliott. No, that would what? be a, that would be a diss if they had Amber Riley. A diss? She's an actress, head crack. I think Kenan Thompson should do it. <laughs> That's so rude. Rude. <laughs> but you know, and I hear correct, Timberland. They nailed Timberland. They, that, that is a good Timberland. No. That's not no damn good Timberland. That guy is pretty, and they probably don't look nothing like Timberland. Timberland is pretty too. It's just a he nice ain't dark that pretty. picture. Mm -hmm. But the casting directors, they would get all these pretty light skinned people to be these people. But so you're saying, so you're being somewhat racist yourself because you're calling these people ugly. No, Someone. I'm not saying they're ugly, but they don't look nothing like them. I mean, I mean, you know, we are dealing with Lifetime. I mean, they did cast Agnes Bruckner for Anna Nicole Smith, Lindsay Lohan for Elizabeth Taylor. So, hey, I mean, really, what do you expect? So, Portia, who can play you? Oh, Halle Berry. I would nominate Cicely Tyson to pay her. To play Portia? Yeah, Cicely Tyson would make a damn good Portia. And you know what? Conrad Murray could play you. <laughs> <laughs> Breaking news. We're being told you ain't subscribed yet. Our sources say you need a little nudge. So go ahead. Go on. Subscribe. <laughs>